Hey, this is another episode of uh, Cooking Outdoors with High Speed Gym. Uh, practicing some meals for um, when I go start going camping this fall. So I'm back down by the lake this morning. Um, sun's just about to clear the trees, so it's going to warm up. But the bad thing is, is there's no breeze this morning. But anyway, let's get this started. Apparently it's going to be one of those mornings where I drop stuff. And, uh, I am going to make pancakes and sausage for breakfast. I've got this little shake and pour uh, pancake mix. You just add water to it, shake it up in the bottle, pour it in the pan, and um, make pancakes. And I also brought some little sausages from the house, so I'm gonna go ahead and get those started. And syrup for the uh, pancakes, can't forget that. Apparently the uh, bottom of the <laughs> frying pan is so slippery that it won't stay on the on the stove. So I've got to figure out something to uh, put under the table now to level it out. I'll be back in a minute. And we're back. Got the uh, table a little more level. And we're just having one of those mornings. I just noticed my uh, spatula got broke on the way here. Oh well, I got enough of it to uh, flip my pancakes. It's always an adventure. disaster this morning. Who knew this frying pan was so slick on the bottom? <laughs> It works really good at the house on the stove top. Sausages sizzling. Smells really good. Just shake them about a little bit. And I brought my uh, bottle of water with me. And once I get done cooking the sausages, I can um, squirt a little bit of water in there, slosh it around a little bit. It'll steam off, you know, any of the burnt sausage. This is why you practice this stuff so that you 
know what the challenges are. Maybe I'll have to try one of my other stoves for the uh, when I'm using my frying pan. Water. On a measuring cup. water in here. Right. My sausages are done. Cup of water. Pour that in. Good. So the uh, firing pan is still hot enough. Okay. That'll be good. Can't see the flame at all because of the the glare, but you can definitely feel the heat. So I'm going to bring the uh, warm up pan a little bit. Pancakes, the mix looks like it's mixed good. So what I'm looking for when I cook pancakes is the bubbles and then usually what I want is right around the edge I want it to kind of like dry out start cooking you know that parts cooked and that lets me know when the pancakes are ready to be flipped so I can kind of see right around this edge kind of starting to firm up and I'm getting bubbles now this first pancake I know is going to be hard to flip just because I didn't really clean out the pan because I wanted some of that seasoning from the sausage in there and see how I'm getting the bubbles so I'm gonna go ahead and attempt to flip this we'll see how I do here down here where you can see. Yeah, it's stuck to the pan big time. A lot of times I'll sacrifice my first pancake. terrible I flipped it too early but that's all right 
the second one will be much better. And actually, I'm sure this one will taste fine. It's uh, not very pretty because the, the skin is stuck to the pan, but pancake will taste the same. This one's going to be better. We're not quite there yet. I think the, I think the third one will be the charm. We'll see how this one comes out. <laughs> Trick's always flipping them. So I think I've got the heat just about right, which is a good thing. Um, you got pretty good control on this stove. And if I think it's getting too hot, I can always, you know, lift it off for a moment. But I think we're good. We're just not going to have pretty pancakes this morning. That's all right. I'm sure they're going to taste fine. Usually once you do one or two, then, you know, you get enough stuff in the pan and they come right up. But, I don't know. Fighting me this morning. I gotta try one more. See if we can get a good one out. Pancakes bubbling up. Ooh. We'll give this one a minute more. We're going for that golden brown. We're not there yet. Well, no pretty pancakes this morning. This one uh, kind of tore the skin a little bit. I, didn't, I guess I didn't wait quite long enough, but that's why you practice this stuff. I'm sure they're going to taste just fine, but what can you do? All right, turn off the heat. Stack of pancakes, got my tea, got my syrup, my sausage. I did remember to bring silverware. I should have just quit with the sausage. <laughs> I always like to try one without the uh, syrup. It tastes like pancakes. It's always a good thing. 
They're pretty good. A bit of maple syrup. Okay, maybe a lot of maple syrup, but Mmm. Those are good pancakes. With some sausage. Sitting down here on the lake. I just heard some birds in the distance. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and enjoy my breakfast. Um, this has been High Speed Gym. And we'll see you guys next time. Thanks.